Hello friends, today we will do chapter number 7, Programming in Scratch 3.0. Part A, Pick the correct answers. First, which of the following button is used to run more than one script at the same time? Green flag. Second, the sprite says the answer using which block? C. Third, which of the following blocks can add a condition in a scratch project? If. Fourth, which of these has blocks that are used to add conditions in a program? Control. Fifth, it is used to create customized blocks in scratch. My blocks. Part B. Fill in the blanks. First, C block is also called dash blocks, control blocks. Second, in the ask and wait block, you can type your answer using a keyboard. Third, the events block menu has blocks that are used to add conditions in a program. Fourth, the when key pressed block is present in the wrap block menu. Fifth, using the dash flag button, you can run the scripts. Green. Part C. Write T for true and F for false. First, the value of variable does not change at the time of execution of a program. False. Second, logical thinking is used to solve complex problems. True. Third, the touching color block is a part of the control block menu. False. Fourth, the if block is used to add a condition in a program. True. Fifth, you can also run a script by pressing a key from the keyboard. True. Question number one. Explain in brief about the control block menu. Answer. The control block menu contains blocks that control the execution of a script. It is used to add programs and conditions in a program. Question number 2. Why do we use conditions in a program? Answer. When we add conditions in a program, it gives more than one result. The control block menu has blocks that are used to add conditions in a program. Question number 3. How do you use keyboard keys in a scratch project? Explain briefly. Answer. The keyboard keys can be selected from the drop down area inside the block. The when key prost block performs an action once the keyboard key is pressed. Question number 4. How can you add a question and answer in scratch? Answer. The ask and wait block asks a question and stores the keyboard input in the answer block. The question appears in a speech bubble. Answer. Now, enter the answer and press the enter key. Question number 5. What are hat blocks? Give two examples. Answer. Hat blocks are used to begin every script as it has a rounded top and a hump at the bottom. The blocks can be placed only below them because of its shape when clicked. Example, when clicked or when key pressed. When we click this option, it shows many options. For example, right arrow key, space key, left arrow key, up arrow key, down arrow key etc. Thank you friends.